this first example, I want to share with you how a photo from Facebook can end up on Twitter, regardless of your Facebook privacy settings. And this assumes that you are using a, an image posted by one of your friend, Facebook friends. So this assumes that you are friends of the person who posted the image. And here's the key. If you can see an image on a Facebook profile, then you can share it. And I'll show you how it's done. So I'm here on my friend's Facebook profile. This is Bonnie Lo Craman. She's a friend and colleague of mine. And I have asked her for permission to, to use hers as an example. And what I want to show you is how I can um, find an image on her profile and then post it on Twitter. So I scroll down and I see a, an image that she's posted. This is a, a picture of her family over the holidays. And I simply click on the picture like I normally would when I'm browsing my, my friend's Facebook profiles. And all I do is I simply right click on the image and choose Save Image As. And I'm going to save it into my downloads folder, which is fine. And I'm going to call this um, Bonnie's Family During the Holidays and then choose save. Next what I'll do is I just go over to my Twitter account and I'll say um, Bonnie Bonnie celebrating the holidays with her family and add my picture here go to my downloads add the image and then tweet it out to my followers. So that's how you share a photo from Facebook onto your Twitter account. Now the proper thing to do would be to check the privacy settings for the photograph before you share any picture. You know the the great thing about social media, about Facebook and Twitter and, and all of these different social media sites is the ability to share. But it's important to think about the privacy that is set by the person who originally posted it and out of respect for their privacy. And the way you could do that, but when you look at an image, there is um, kind of an icon, it's a privacy icon below the name of the person that posted it and it tells you what the privacy setting is for this photo. So Bonnie has actually posted this image and said, you know, we could. Sh this is a public photo. Anyone that subscribes to Bonnie's um, updates can can view the photo, and so she's probably okay with me sharing. But the proper thing to do would be to ask for permission um, to share this photo because it, it is a photo of her family. I am not in this photograph, so I would want to ask for permission. If, if you're, when in doubt, ask for permission. In this next example, I want to show you how you can tell what the privacy settings are for an image that you see in your newsfeed. Here's an, an image of my friend Bonnie and myself at a, a workshop in San Francisco, and she recently tagged me in this, this image. And what I'll do, if, it's, if this is sitting in my newsfeed, you could still tell the privacy settings here. When I hover, you'll notice that there's not a globe this time. If you hover over this image, instead of it being a globe, it's these um, people profiles. So you can tell that the privacy is a little bit different than before. It also tells you when you hover over it that this is Bonnie's post and it's been shared with Bonnie's friends. It's really important to see that. The very first thing, the highest priority is that it's been shared with just Bonnie's friends first. And then as soon as she tags me, then Facebook identifies it in the privacy that it says and some of Vicky's friends. So it's because she tagged me in the photo that it's it gets broadcast out to my news feed and, and to my friends um, in my circle. So that's how you can check the privacy settings for an image in your news feed. And, and obviously I can click on the image here and it will take me to a larger version of the image and the, the post, um, the comments but I can simply right click on this image and save the picture as and I'm using Internet Explorer this time and then save the image um, on my computer.
and then broadcast to Twitter. But obviously, I'd, I'd want to, you know, certainly ask for permission first if to make sure it's okay for me to broadcast to Twitter. So the last thing I want to do is show you how to set the privacy settings for an image that you're posting onto Facebook, and I'll show you how to do that. So I'm going to go to my profile page, and I'm going to go ahead and upload a photo. And I'll go here and just look for JPEGs. And here's one of me in DC. Um, yeah, we'll do that one. And what you'll want to do is to set your privacy settings. To the left of the post button, here is the option right here to share it with the world or share it with just your friends or share it with your friends and then their friends. So here I could say I want to share it publicly. Um, here is uh, friends, only me, or I can do a custom privacy setting. So here I could say I want to uh, go ahead and post it to the public and then here is, um, I'll just set that to friends. Um, testing of photo privacy probably should have checked that photo before I uploaded it. That's how you um, share photos properly and set the privacy, uh, privacy for each one of your images on Facebook. Um, and you also saw how to look at the privacy settings for images that your friends have posted. So hopefully that's helpful. Read the blog post below to get more information uh, about these different tips. Okay, see you next time.